hello everyone today in this video we are going to delete our category so let's go here and uh, start our work so here i'm going to after this one i'm going to uh, i will add this so uh, at the end of this so here i'm going to uh, add a body i'm going to click on body and then here i'm going to implement on and on but i want to implement this so uh, on click and then which on click i want to click on this uh, del button which we define this in the controller in the href and then i need to pass this uh, function callback and do implement this here right so first i want to grab its uh, id so id would be the mm, this okay this dot uh, data id oops data ID. what the hell is this why it's not doing okay and here i'm going to console dot to log it's same for this one so i'm not going to make this console log again so i'm going to basically send the request to on a new route so let me create a new route so basically i'm going to implement a new route which is a delete route let me copy this out so here made this delete not post or something else right so let's uh, remove this and implement delete slash id okay delete id and here i'm going to call this so uh, let's try let's try let me copy this let's try and add this let's try here because you need to make this same convention into all over okay so this is also accepting an id in the parameter so here i'm going to add this public uh, function uh, dash try right and the dash try i'm accepting an id and if i got any id if i did not got any id so i'm going to first to search this id in the database and then if i do not find this i will abort this and if i find this i'm going to return this category right it's pretty same we are uh, displaying here so here we are displaying and then we will delete this later right so let's go here and do implement this ajax call so now i'm going to copy this ajax call for time saving right so this one is a ajax call copy this and uh, paste it here so here i'm passing this uh, category so uh, slash id so i need to remove this so uh, last stuff from there and then i'm going to make this so uh, destroy slash id that's good and here i need to pass the oops here i need to pass this uh, delete uh delete okay now it's delete and then i don't want to display a model here don't want to add this into the form don't want to add this uh, here don't want to capitalize this one remove this stuff from there and then here if i find this uh, id so then i'm going to delete this uh, id and display a message here right so what i'm going to display a message i'm going to basically grab this swell function swell is used to display a toaster right so here i'm going to display a toaster with the message response dot success so i will add the success badge in the json right so here i'm going to add this so uh, Mm, this will be returned we are returning this it will return as json and it will behave like this will be deleted right so let's give it refresh and check that uh, is it working or not so let me charge my pc okay and uh, here i'm going to click on the any of the category click on delete so it's not going to do anything it says that sweet alert is invalid hmm. why it says oh sweet alert is invalid because we are not returning any success right 
so i'm going to first to delete this category i'm not going to make this test because i know this will be deleted so let's uh, delete uh, this delete this and after this i'm going to return response and response would be the json and then this json would be contain a success property and then this success would be contain category deleted oops deleted success fully right and then i'm going to pass this 201 which is the success code so save this one let's get refresh and this record will be deleted because it's um, only um, throwing the swell error so it's mean that it comes inside the uh, inside the this uh, hidden so it's not going to delete it because we added this deleted right now so now it's going to delete i'm going to delete this larina click down it so it says category deleted and it's not updating why because we need to add the we need to call this table draw method right so here before this we need to add this so table dot to draw as we added this in the in the store method right so if i get refreshed this four will be deleted because our dom is did not refreshed and yes it's deleted so if i click on this so three so it's going to delete the three and update it instantly okay and yes instantly it's updated so if i click on this five it's going to delete and instantly it's going to update the draw and it says that the straw uh, slash 5 not found because I double clicked on it so you can also prevent it when we when I'm clicking on it so you can disable this button so how you can disable this so let me check the video size 